in the last video we learnt about the fishing industry and the IT industry. Today in this video we will be learning about the shipbuilding industry and the automobile industry. All of us here know that the Indus Valley Civilization is one of the oldest civilizations of humankind, right? So when this civilization was being excavated, Lothal was discovered. What is Lothal? Well, Lothal is believed to be an important ancient port area where ships were built. So it is very obvious from this point that shipbuilding industry is not a new industry but it is one of the oldest industries in the world. Just like the Indus Valley civilization, even when the Egyptian civilization was being excavated, port was unearthed at Egypt near Pyramid of Giza. You must have heard about this great pyramid of Giza and archaeologists believe that this big pyramid was built using big stones. These stones were brought to this pyramid with the help of canals and harbors. So it is making it very evident that shipbuilding is no new industry and has been present since a very long time. Here's a painting that depicts the Egyptian sailing ship from 1420 BCE. That's a very old time, right? So you see that shipbuilding has been present since many, many years and it is also an important industry as it helped the different civilizations to carry on with their trade and explore different places on the earth and also expand their civilization. So, Talking about the shipbuilding industry, the shipbuilding industry is an engineering industry. Why so? Because it produces ships for military and commercial use. It also includes the repairing of ships and the manufacturing of marine equipments. So you see how important this industry is. It helps in producing ships for military use. So you see that it benefits the nation or it helps in expanding the military base of a nation. It also helps in producing ships for commercial use. Means it helps in bringing in foreign exchange and expanding the economic activity in any country, thus helping it grow. Other than that, it also repairs ships, old ships or torn out ships and it also helps in manufacturing different marine equipments that is used for various purposes. So while talking of the shipbuilding industry, these are the different types of ships that are manufactured across the world. And what are these? You have the naval ships, you have the ocean liners or crews, then you have these tankers that is usually carrying crude oil from oil fields to oil refineries and then you have these cargo vessels that carries products or goods from one country to another. So while talking of the shipbuilding industry, Hyundai Heavy Industry in South Korea is one of the leading companies across the world. However, China is believed to be the current leader in the global ship deliveries. From this map, you can see that China is the current leader in the ship deliveries across the world, followed by South Korea and Japan. So before moving on, could you help me answer this question? Which country is the current leader in global ship deliveries? Is it Bangladesh or is it Brazil or is it China? or is it Nigeria? Yes, we just saw that China is the current leader in global ship deliveries. So this is a map that is showing us the major shipbuilding centers in India. And what are these? These are Mumbai, Kochi, Vishakapatnam, and Kolkata. 
From the map, it is very obvious that the major shipbuilding centers are located along the coastlines, as you can just see. So this makes it very convenient for these industries or for these centers to manufacture ships and then carry on with the shipbuilding industry or with different types of trades. So here we learnt about the shipbuilding industry that is an engineering industry and it is used to produce ships for military as well as commercial use. Right? We also learn that the shipbuilding industry has been one of the most oldest industries in the present world. It has been present since the Egyptian Valley Civilization and the Indus Valley Civilization. Right? We also saw how shipbuilding centers are located along the coastlines, making it very convenient for these centers or for these cities to carry on with their shipbuilding industry. So let's learn about the automobile industry now. In this video, you can see that different parts of the cars are being brought together by using high advanced technology machines, modern machines and a huge labor force. So th you see, this is a large scale heavy industry, right? So the automobile industry is also an engineering industry like the shipbuilding industry, which produces cars, as you can see here. However, the automobile industry is a part of the automotive industry which deals with the designing, manufacturing and selling of motor vehicles. Motor vehicles like cars, trucks, buses, scooters, motorbikes and other motor vehicles. So we understood that the automobile industry is an engineering industry that produces cars and also that it is a part of the automotive industry which deals with the manufacturing and processing of motor vehicles, different motor vehicles like cars, buses, scooters, trucks, etc. Also, the first major motor company, namely the Detroit Automobile Company, was established in Detroit, USA by Henry Ford in 1903. The usual car making process involves the following and what are these? We have designing. So first the car is to be designed by different engineers or car designers. After designing is done, the production facilities are modified as per the design of the car. Right? After these two are done, then the construction of the automobile or the car is done and then it is validated from different engineers. Right. So after construction and validation, we have the quality improvement or the quality check. So once the quality check is done and the improvements are made, then the performance check comes into play. So it is seen whether the car is performing properly, whether all the parts are functioning properly or not. Right? So after the performance check, we finally have the training of workforce. Right? So the training of workforce may be taking place after the process or while the process is going on. So the car making industry or the automobile industry tains a large workforce which makes it a large scale industry and thus it is also known as an employment generator. So you see that these are the different processes that is involved in making a car. So you can see that in 1903 when the first motor company was established, then these processes may or may not have been present. But over the years, the automobile industry has advanced and become more modern. So these different processes makes it very sure that the automobile industry produces good quality cars and it performs very well, right? Now let's locate the important automobile industries in India. See, so the important automobile industries in India are located in Delhi, Chennai, Pune and Mumbai. Even a developing country like India has now become an important or a major exporter of automobiles across the world. The automobile industry in India plays a very important role in India's economy. This is a pie chart showing India's car market share in 2021. It is very obvious from the picture that the major portion of the pie chart 
is occupied by Maruti Suzuki. So Maruti Suzuki tops the list of the market share in India in 2021. Followed by Maruti Suzuki, we have Hyundai, Tata Motors, Mahindra and Mahindra and the other automobile companies. So you see in India, Maruti Suzuki is playing an important role in expanding or carrying on with the automobile industry. Now let us look at the leading producers of automobiles in the world. And what are these? These are USA, Germany, India, China, South Korea and Japan. Out of these countries, China is the largest producer of automobiles in the world. The major automobile manufacturing companies are Toyota of Japan, Volkswagen of Germany and Hyundai of South Korea. So today in this video, we learned about the shipbuilding industry. We learned how old the industry is and how important a role it plays in a country's economy. We also learned about the automobile industry, which is an engineering industry that deals with the production of cars. It is a part of the automotive industry, which deals with the manufacturing and processing of motor vehicles that may include car, buses, trucks, and many other such motor vehicles. We also learned that the automobile industry is an important industry in countries like India, and India now is one of the major exporters of automobiles across the world. Other than that, we learned that China is the largest producer of automobiles in the world, and these are some of the most important manufacturing companies of automobiles in the world. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. You can also register for free at deltastep.com or download the Delta Step app to learn one-to-one -one with our amazing teachers or to get access to all our 5,000 plus amazing videos as per your school syllabus. Master each topic with our adaptive practice technology. Get million plus questions with step-by-step -step solutions and unlimited mock test. Get all your doubts resolved instantly. Learn via games and win amazing prizes like PlayStations and iPads. So at Delta Step, learning is not just fun and easy, it is rewarding too. So register for free now.